Hi Bulldog fans, welcome to the 2014 Ferris State Football Media Photo Day. We'll check in with some players and get their expectations for the 2014 season as preseason camp comes to a close. Jason, two weeks into, into preseason camp here, uh, talk about how things have gone here as you get ready for the season opener. Yeah, it's definitely been our best camp that we've had since I've been here. Uh, we've dealt with a couple of banged up injuries. Luckily, we've had nothing serious happen across our whole team. We really just had a couple bumps and bruises, so we know we'll be good by game week. But it's just nice to return a lot of guys. Uh, the old line's looking really, really good, especially just pass protection. Uh, everything else is just getting real solid up front. We're not having any mistakes, so it's looking like we're going to have a good year. Talk about that returning experience and the, the number of guys you have coming back and, and how that's changed maybe over the last couple years uh, in terms of getting ready for that season opener. Yeah, it just definitely helps leadership-wise, uh, helping other guys, helping the freshmen get the new plays down and just helping other guys get our whole system together. We've really just been able to execute things. We haven't had to waste time, you know, trying to learn new plays or trying to, you know, execute some new because we already have everything in, so it's really helped just having all the guys out there. Junior year here uh, for the Bulldogs, uh, just talk about how how this camp maybe for you has been different being being one of the older guys, one of the one of the leaders here on this defense. Um, this year it's been a little different because it's more of like refining my skills versus in the past you would take a ton of reps just trying to get you more experience in the system. But this year it's more focusing on the little things that you need to improve, I think. A uh, new defensive coordinator obviously uh, with, with the change on the defensive side. Uh, how, how has that went here through the preseason? Um, it's been a little bit different, but for the most part, we're keeping the same system, doing the same things. It's really, it's just getting uh, used to a new leadership, and uh, Coach Hodge is going to do a great job, so we'll be good to go anyways. Jake, being a senior here uh, for the Bulldogs, uh, talk about uh, how this how this camp's been different for you and, and how excited you are for the season to start. It's definitely uh, bittersweet. You know, I wish I could stay longer. Um, I wish I could be here for another year. Um, but it's a really exciting time in Bulldog football, and I'm just blessed to be a part of it. Um, I'm glad that I can step on this field with the guys that I've made relationships with here and, you know, that I consider my brothers. And it's just a, it's a fun time for me, and I'm going to just soak in every moment and take, uh, take each moment game by game, practice by practice, and just know that, you know, this, is, this could be my last go around. So uh, it's definitely exciting. Talk about the offense, uh, how camps went so far with the number of guys you have coming back and, and how you're clicking offensively. That's really fun to talk about. I mean, just having so many people back and so many leaders on the offense, um, it's just, it's really cool to look at. And, you know, we've all worked really hard in the offseason and we pride ourselves on that. And as an offense as a whole, we know how good we are and we know that the only, the only defense that can beat Ferris State is the Ferris State offense. And so we like to think that we can take on any defense in the country, any defense in the GLIAC, and just know that no matter what, the only team that can stop us is ourselves because of the leadership that we have, um, the skills that we have. We got a lot of new guys in here that are clicking really well with, with the leaders and the new guys, and it's just it's really fun to see everyone unite on the offense, especially with the guys that are already here. And we haven't taken any steps back. If anything, we've made more steps in the off season because we've been here so many years and we've gotten the system down now. It's just gonna be really fast paced, really fun, and hopefully a little bit more throwing. Adam, uh, one, of the, one of the returners on the offensive line, uh, talk about uh, the experience here in preseason camp, how that's uh, changed maybe over the last couple of years uh, with the fact so many more guys are back. I mean, it's nice having a bunch of guys back because we're able to roll quicker and, you, you know, just get stuff accomplished faster. And it's been a little bit better for us older guys because we're able to help the young guys out now instead of having to just think for ourselves. Lost a couple guys on the offensive line, but a great nucleus coming back. Uh, talk about how some of those younger guys have developed and, and what they're going to bring. Uh, we've got a couple, well, we've got a freshman who's doing really good right now, and then we've got a couple of younger guys like Jake Doherty, and then like a couple of older guys too, like Jake Vanderklok and Brian Bell have really stepped up to help us out. How, how excited are you for that season opener at McKendree in uh, about a week and a half? Uh, I can't wait. I mean, we're only a couple days or a couple weeks away, so it's coming. With the fact that you're a junior, uh, one of the captains now uh, here for the Bulldogs, uh, what, what kind of expectations do you have for this season? I have extremely high expectations. It's GLIAC title and national championship. That's what I'm expecting. Thanks for tuning in to the 2014 Ferris State Football Media Photo Day. A reminder, you can follow all the action online at ferrostatebulldogs.com.